Hi, I'm Greg with Parent Finder. Today we're going to create a new photo album. We're going to upload to that album. We're going to reorganize the photos in that album. We're going to edit the size of those photos and caption on those photos. First thing we want to do is log in. So using my username and password We hit log in, and that will take us to our family dashboard page, driven by icons. To do anything you need to do with your profile, the family dashboard page shows us that uh, here we can manipulate photos. What we do is scroll down, we can see the albums that we've already created, and hit create album to create our new one. And this will be new photos. 2015. The description, these are our new photos. Click create and you can see that we've created the new photo album. So what we want to do is click in there to be able to add photos to that album. These pink rectangles are action items. This one tells us that we can upload files. Uh, right down here, Add Files, which takes us to our hard drive on our computer. And I have created a folder that's titled Greg and Keeley Photos. I'll go ahead and drag my mouse across all of those photos to upload them into the new album. You can see through the thumbnails that it's populating those photos into that photo album, uh, where we can see the size of these photos. And what we're noticing here is a 48K photo is way too small to be able to commercially print. So we're not going to use these photos to print our adoption profile. It will just be viewed online. And that's important. So uh, it says to click OK to exit. And uh, that's what I'll do. And that takes us back into our photo album and what I want to do is I want to take this photo from the gardens that we shot this summer and I want to move that to be the first photo that you can see so see what I did here was I went to that plus sign with my mouse I clicked down with my mouse and that gave me the ability to move this and change the order of all of these photos so here we are at the ballet. I want to move a photo of Keely and I dressed up, and we'll show that one second. Here's another one where we went to a gala, and uh, so I want to show that one as third. So we've changed the order of the photos as they appear in our photo album. And next, what I want to be able to do is uh, I want to edit this photo. I want to change the size of that photo. So uh, what I do is I click on it to uh, edit, and what we do here is these icons here tell us what we can do with this photo. We're going to edit this photo. Brings up the photo editor dashboard. I'm going to crop this photo. I'm going to take this out of the background. So what I can do here is drag it just like the editor in your iPhone and I'm um, going to change the aspect ratio and move it to eliminate some of this background from the side. Here I hit apply, save those changes. You can see it's saving those changes right now to our album and uh, then I can click out and you'll notice that I've changed the dimensions of that photo. Now I can uh, click on one to edit and it's going to bring up the opportunity to be able to caption on that photo. Greg and Keeley at the Nutcracker and uh, hit save. So there we've misspelled my name, which is always good.
You want to make sure you can do that. Misspell your name every opportunity. So what I want to do is go back in and make the change. Okay, there, Greg and Keeley at the Nutcracker. Hit save. Now you can see the caption. So what we did was we created a new album. We went into that album. We uploaded photos. We changed the order of the photos. We cropped the photo. And then we captioned on the photo. Thanks very much for watching. As always, if you ever have questions about Parent Finder, feel free to email us at info at parentfinder.com. We're happy to answer your questions.